Good morning, folks. Frank Zavilla here, Zor Capital, the 13th of April, 8 o'clock in the morning. I want to do a quick video going over Investors Business Daily digital newspaper or digital website. Uh, very simply, IBD does a great job narrowing down the universe of 5,000 stocks to roughly a select few based on technicals and fundamentals. And very simply, when you go onto investors.com, they make it real simple. Uh, what I do every day is I go here to stock list and they break down the best stocks that are, be that, that are performing the best based on fundamentals and technicals. And they have here the IBD 50, the sector lead is a stock spotlight, IBD cap 20. So if you don't have much time to go through a lot of stocks, I think this is the best way to combine fundamentals and technicals. So what I do every morning, I go through this entire list uh, which I did already, and then I came across one stock that I believe is actionable today, if and only if it can go through today's high, yesterday's highs. Uh, so again, uh, it's an IBD 50 name, which very simply, according to IBD, their IBD 50 name is you know one of their best screens. Uh, the flagship screen of of leading growth stocks gives you 50 companies showing strong relative price strength and top-notch fundamentals. So that's our IBD 50, uh, comes out once a week in their paper. And the second one is Sector Leaders, which is probably my favorite. And it just so happens that the Sector Leader list is their most stringent list, and that's typically where they get their biggest winners from. So either way, the stock that I'm looking at today is Grubhub, which is right over here. Um, Again, real quick, the most stringent and powerful screen sector leaders highlight the best stocks in IBD's 33 sectors. All sector leaders show outstanding earnings and sales growth in recent quarters and are strong across many other fundamental and price performance metrics. The stock that I, uh, that I believe is actionable today is Grubhub. Uh, which is number 12 here. It's also an IBD 50 name. And very simply, what you want to do is you click on this little arrow here and it gives you a quick snapshot of the market direction, which is in, you know recently in an uptrend. It gives you the industry rank 27. It gives you the group relative strength, which is an A. It gives you uh, the EPS day, EPS rating of 98, EPS changed last quarter. It gives you a quick snapshot just to let you know how well the company is doing fundamentally and also technically. I think it's very important because again, if you're you know someone who believes in, in, in fundamentals and technicals, this is the easiest way to narrow down the universe of stocks uh, based on those two factors. Uh, and IBD just makes it real simple for you. So once you come across all this, you get the chart right below. You can easily click on here, which is Market Smith, which is their premium product. And it gives you this look, uh, this great looking chart over here. And again, here's Grubhub, okay? Last four quarters, EPS change, 45%, plus 13, plus 22, plus 61. Estimates for 2018 are roughly 42%. Uh, if you look at the sales, up 39, 32, 32, 49. And here, this little gap up was based on, was earnings related. The stock, you know, the way I view charts, this is actionable to me. The stock printed an inside day yesterday. It's actionable to me if it goes through that high with a stock right over here, which is roughly $96 a share. Or right over here, $96 a share. Again, so in a situation like this, I'm looking at a company that's fundamentally sound. So, you know, 939.45, I'll go in there, I'll put a buy stop order at $100.49. If it gets hit, great, I'm in. If it doesn't, no big deal. And if I do get hit, then I'm putting a stop uh, immediately at $96 a share. And again, this is the easiest way to combine fundamentals and technicals by using IBD. So trade them well and be well.